how I use a three act structure to make videos that generate leads for my business. Sure. Yeah. I mean, I'll, I'll be awake for a whole week, but it's cool. <laughs> Thanks. Now, the way the three act structure actually works is act one is going to be your setup. And the setup is basically the hook is where you really want to start, where you're taking them throughout this video, whether it's a 15 second video or a 10 minute video or 15 minute video. You definitely want to set that up. Act two is actually the conflict, right? What are you going to talk about? What is it that your business actually does for them? And then act three is going to be the resolution, right? In this scenario, we're talking about the call to action. What's going to be your call to action? Where do you want to lead them to? What information you want to give them so that way they can reach out to you. Now, when you're making these videos, you want to have an effect of some sort of feeling that's going to make them keep watching but also at the end we'll actually do the call to action now i'm going to show you guys some clips of some videos and i just want to see how you guys feel when you actually watch these videos because that really makes a difference when you're watching a video and it really conveys what the video is really about But I really wanted to show these two because one is a very more emotional one uh, with the dog and that's a Budweiser commercial. And the first one was actually a trip I took with my wife and some friends to uh, the Magic Kingdom in Florida, Orlando, Florida. So I just wanted to show you guys these two clips just to see if you get the feeling that I get. The first one is of happiness. It was a great trip, it was fun. And then the second one was a little more emotional because it had a story behind it. And I think if we take the three X structure and we use that to convey our messages through video in that form, I think we could definitely increase not only our engagement, but our lead flow to our business as well. Now, how do you actually use a three act structure? I'm gonna give you guys an example of how I like helping real estate agents set up videos that actually generate leads for them on YouTube. So the first thing I always tell them is, who's your target audience? Is it a buyer or a seller? Is it somebody who's looking to buy right now or looking to buy later? Most of them, of course, you wanna buy right now. Are you relocating and buying a home in the city of Irvine? But you're really trying to figure out what's the best neighborhood to move to based on your budget and lifestyle. Well, guess what, guys? Today, I'm going to be talking about the neighborhood of West Park. So that's going to be your setup. So you know who you're targeting. You know specifically you're looking for somebody who's actually ready to buy and relocate to the city of Irvine. And now you can actually show them what the neighborhood actually offers, which is exactly what they want to see. Because the one thing when it comes to home buyers is they always purchase the neighborhood first before they know what home they're going to buy. Act two is going to be the conflict. Now the conflict in this scenario is you talking about the pros and cons of this particular neighborhood. You really want to be honest with the viewer. You want to show them what this neighborhood actually offers from, hey, these are great schools in this area. It's a walkable neighborhood. Your close proximity to the freeways, easy access to that, bike trails. But you also want to talk about the cons. Hey, you know what, around this time, between four and seven, you're gonna get some traffic on this particular street. But the great thing is, since the school actually sits within the neighborhood, you don't actually have to cross a major neighborhood to take your kids to school. You really wanna give them as much information so that way they know that you're the expert in that area and you're the one showing them this video. Because the reality is not a lot of people are making video content for their business. And in this scenario, as a real estate agent, you really wanna showcase the neighborhood and talk about it in your own opinion, in your own experience. And that's really the conflict, right? The conflict for the viewer is, is this the right neighborhood for me to move into based on the information that you're actually providing? 
And the more honest you are with them, the more you show who you really are in regards to your personality, the more you are gonna attract those leads that actually reach out to you because you're one of a few who are actually making these type of videos. Now for act three, this is the resolution. And this is really where the call to action comes in. Let's go back to the real estate scenario. Example, what did you guys think about this neighborhood? Is there something that you guys liked or didn't like? Or what are your thoughts? Are you guys looking to relocate to this particular neighborhood? If you are, we would love to hear from you guys or just hear your thoughts in regards to this particular neighborhood. Put them in the comment section below. We would love to hear from you guys. But if you're ready to go and you're looking to relocate to this particular neighborhood, or maybe you just have some questions, reach out to us. We would love to help you out. But if this neighborhood doesn't fit your budget or lifestyle, check out this other video that I made about Woodbridge neighborhood. But either way, guys, we look forward to helping you soon. And that's how I'm starting to use a 3X structure to actually make my videos even better. But I've also made these videos in the past to generate leads on my real estate business. And that's why I wanted to talk about that example in regards to the real estate side, because videos that I made two, three, four years ago in regards to my real estate business, I still generate leads with those videos. And those are the things and topics that I actually talk about. And that's how I use a 3X structure to generate leads, not only in my business, but also for my clients in regards to my marketing agency. But you guys let me know what you guys thought about this video. If you guys have any questions, put them in the comment section below. I would love to help you guys out or answer any questions. Either way guys, I will definitely see you guys on the next video. Breaking news. Did you guys know that you can make marketing videos that generate leads by using the 3X structure? Huh, what do you know?